Uh, BC's new leader of the NDP, Adrian Dix, and Premier Christy Clark can agree on at least one thing already. They will give voters a clear choice in the next election. And they also agree that that shouldn't happen until after the HST referendum. So who is Adrian Dix? He is a well-known fixture in BC politics and has been for more than 15 years and not always for good reason. But the longtime activist and insider and now NDP leader says he's looking to move forward and to take his party to victory in the next election. And his legislature reporter Shachi Curl has the story in you at six. Hail to the conquering hero. Adrian Dix met with his caucus today, his first time as leader. Dix, a sometimes marathoner, is now in training to take on Christy Clark and the BC Liberals. We're going to be running a legislative session that holds the government accountable and is also a forum for our positive proposals for change. But who is this new opposition leader? The man who would be the first new Democrat premier in more than a decade. A longtime social activist, longtime NDPer. We first got to know him as former Premier Glenn Clark's principal secretary, infamously cut loose when he backdated a memo in an attempt to protect the boss from scandal. You've been fired? Um, yeah, I've been replaced. Yeah. The taint has followed him, but Dix has gone on to be elected MLA twice and serve as the NDP's unrelenting health critic. When is the Minister of Health going to stop attacking the messenger and do something to help patients? It goes without saying that he was also a staunch Carol James loyalist during her darkest days. It's now up to Dix to unite the party and chart a clearer path. And for him, that means going back to the NDP's core roots. Alternatives on public health care, where the difference is between myself and uh, Premier Clark, could not be more stark. At the outset, Dix told us he wanted to square off against Christy Clark in a provincial election. The Premier says she's ready. There is now a very clear difference between what we're about, which is change, and looking forward and doing things differently, and what they're about, which is really, I think, you know, g going backwards. And we all remember what the 1990s were like. So I think voters want a clear choice, and I think now they've got one. Game on. Look for Adrian Dix to bring the same focus, the same aim to the political arena as he brings to the basketball court. In Victoria, Shachi Curl, A News.